I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. A pork plant is having to idle for a while due to COVID-19. Tyson Foods Pork Processing Plant in Columbus Junction, Iowa, has suspended operations for a week. That's after more than two dozen cases of the virus were confirmed at the facility. Tyson CEO saying the company was diverting the livestock supply scheduled for delivery to that facility to some of the company's other pork plants in the region. The facility kills about 10,000 pigs a day. That's about 2% of the country's total slaughter capacity. And four workers have tested positive for the virus at an Archer Daniels Midland corn processing facility in Clinton, Iowa. Reuters reporting the employees and those they have come in contact with are under quarantine. The facility is also being deep cleaned. A company spokesperson saying that right now they are continuing to keep operations going at the plant with some staffing adjustments. And UPI reporting farmers in Florida are having to destroy millions of pounds of things like green beans, lettuce and tomatoes. That's because there is no market for them. With the closure of many food services and restaurants, farmers were left with a surplus in storage and out in the fields. Growers telling UPI they couldn't find alternatives, so they plowed under the crops. One of the area's hardest hit is South Florida, which produces many vegetables in the winter. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime at agweb.com and follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.